Okay. One more time together. Blackwell, make some noise! And welcome back to a brand new video. So it's Saturday, it's just getting dark and we're going to have a bit of a look around because I think there's a some sort of like an event going on on the comedy carpet at 5pm so we're going to have a, a quick look over there and you can see how many people are coming and going in Blackpool to enjoy another fantastic display and events all around Blackpool so let's just move the camera just to the, uh, the left because there's a little monster hide away, you see that's the, uh, the Holiday Inn that's just recently uh, been opened a few months ago and let's just have a, a quick look because you can see there's a, a monster there and we haven't got that one before because normally we just uh, pop along the uh, promenade when you're trying to hunt for them so there is one directly in front so yeah what we're going to do we're going to have a, a bit of a walk around past the, uh, the winter gardens and have a look on the promenade and just see what's going on on this uh, really nice evening so uh, come and join me certainly looks like uh, Swish the, uh, the Holiday Inn so uh, I believe Stephen Walker on Wildside has done a bit of a video on that one so if you haven't uh, seen that one go and have a look at that so we did a, a great review on that one so yeah so we're going to head down Talbot Road do a left to the uh, the Winter Gardens and go and have a look what's going on on the promenade so as we were walking down to the uh, tram stop that new uh, new one is just on the uh, the right hand side and they've also got a Greg's now which is opened up so I believe there's a, a few shops still waiting um, to uh, to become um, or should I say grab a, a new business in there but yeah the, uh, the first one is Greg's to open and uh, just walking down weaving through the uh, the, the people you see the uh, Mark Kelly's it's all like uh, lit up tonight so I'm not too sure if that's a new sign I haven't seen that one lit up like that one before so uh, this is uh, Talbot Road like I said, that's the, uh, the Mark Ellis, and that sort of stretches all the way to the Gin Roundabout, which is Dixon Road. That's all that will keep moving down. And the one opposite, the Coffee Americano, that's uh, that's okay, carry on. Uh, the Coffee Americano, that's another great one. Just on the corner, so that's been opened up um, a few months now. Yeah, let's have a, a quick look, but look how swish that one looks. Let's just have a, a quick look a little, bit, little nearer. That looks uh, really nice. And, uh, yeah, I'm not too sure what the coffee's like, so I haven't actually been in there. But it certainly looks a nice one. Look at that. So we just stopped briefly at the, uh, the old post office. Now this is uh, under negotiations. Um, however, it's still on. Um, right move for sale in the commercial properties. So you can still actually put a cheeky offer in if you wanted to uh, take advantage. So it is still open to offers. I'm not too sure what the, uh, the current situation is with that one, how far they've progressed. But yeah, you can still put a, a little cheeky offer in if you wanted to. So yeah, let's just head a little bit towards the uh, Winter Gardens. So we just arrived at St John Square now and you can see we've uh, also seen our second monster of the evening just uh, above the, uh, the Winter Garden. So in a, a monster hunt video, this one tonight, it's just a bit of a walk through, see what's going on. And uh, yeah, it's having a, a bit of a look around. But yeah, this is the, uh, the Winter Gardens, uh, straight in front. And we can also see the, uh, the tower lit up in that like pumpkin gold color. How amazing does that look with the, uh, the Vintro Lounge. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll head on into town. So I believe there's some sort of like display or light turn on uh, at 5 p.m. on the comedy carpet. So we'll have a, a bit of a closer look and uh, see what it's, that's all about. Yeah, what a, what a lovely setting that. It takes a magnificent picture. So yeah, another, another lovely little spot, so picturesque. There, especially when all the, uh, the scaffolding is down and you can see we're getting that little bit closer to, uh, to the tower. So it's actually quite busy in town tonight. You see many people are walking about, uh, just enjoying 
what Blackpool has to offer. So yeah, we're going to head on to the, uh, the promenade and hopefully, um, if my sources are right, there might be some sort of like display going on. So you can see somebody's at birthday, they're out celebrating. There we go. What a great way to spend it. <laughs> so you can see we just arrived at the uh, comedy carpet and there's already something going on. See that truck playing music. So imagine this is something to do with the, uh, the, like, the display or something at five o'clock. And uh, yeah, you see everyone's uh, gathering round, enjoying themselves. There it is. Like I said, there's always uh, always something in Blackpool to uh, keep everybody entertained. And that's just uh, a bit of a look from uh, the bottom of uh, the comedy carpet. You see the uh, towers in that lovely orange, goldy colour. And that certainly looks uh, certainly looks nice this evening. Look at that. So just uh, a quick look at the. Um, Christmas market hours uh, coming along. See, people still working away. See that windmill just uh, behind the way. So the, uh, the German sausage and all these are going to be up and ready for the uh, the 13th. So let's just move the camera around to the uh, comedy carpet because you see the light is going, but you see how busy it is tonight. Look at that. It's uh, certainly uh, a hive of activity. And like I said, you know, it's, uh, it's coming up for five o'clock and they're still not finished. And these guys start, you know, very, very early in the morning. All this uh, for everybody to enjoy. You see the, uh, the hoisting up with that crane. It's going uh, into the, uh, the star flyer. And, uh, yeah, they're always, uh, always busy, these guys. So yeah, this is just near the, uh, the spindles and you can see all the, uh, the wonderful lights it's really, like I said, uh, starting to get busy. Like I said, it's only very, very early. And in a couple of hours, you know, you literally won't be able to walk anywhere. And there is a central pier all lit up with the, uh, the big wheel. And you can still see the beach is actually quite busy. Look at that, so the tide is out. And there's still many, many people just enjoying themselves, taking that last bit of, a, last bit of lighting before it disappears. So we'll just pan the camera right round to the, uh, the right-hand side. So it's going from uh, central to North Pier. And uh, there is uh, North Pier. Again, lit up with the uh, the bloom bar, and uh, it's, uh, it's one of my favourites. That one, the uh, the North Pier, and you can see the uh, the tower all lit up. So I was going to walk along because I think we've got another five minutes until five o'clock, and I believe. Uh, there's some like little mini switch on. I'm not too sure exactly what it is, but that's what I was uh, in for. But yeah, you've got the, uh, the Blackpool Amusements. That's been open a couple of years now. And uh, that's also uh, home to a one pound burger. So if you're a bit peckish, they have a, a cafe upstairs and you can grab your lunch just for a pound. That's incredible. So yeah, just uh, moving on a little forward because they've got the, uh, the wedding chapel and all that's lit up. So you normally don't see the wedding chapel lit up at night time. So you actually see right in, it looks like there's a, possibly a wedding going on. So we'll have a, a bit of a closer look um, at that one. Like I said, it's, uh, it's amazing what you do see in the evening, all the, uh, the amazing uh, lights which light up uh, the town. You see, we've got the, uh, the beach house just to the left. Yeah, that's the uh, the wedding chapel. Looks like possibly there's a wedding um, and going on upstairs. And uh, what a great view that would be, overlooking the sea and the tower. 
James, you see uh, like the, uh, the top floor, you can see like, sort of, like guests are being served, so it's possibly a wedding, uh, what's been going on. So we'll just uh, get a little bit closer, just have a, a quick look. But yeah, it's like someone's uh, celebrating a very happy day today. So it's the uh, celebration of the Diwali, I believe. And it looks like they're going to be uh, doing the switch on in Blackpool. The first one um, ever in history. And, uh, yeah, so they're going to be doing the, uh, the switch on very soon. And you see uh, how many people are uh, attending this festival. Yeah, so the switch on should be imminent. Okay, these guys are giving it, giving it. I'm feeling the energy here. I'm going to ask for my left over here. Can I make some noise? Okay, okay, okay. More energy, more energy. Okay. One more time together. Black one, make some noise! That is more like it. So, before we start our next performance, can we have our music to take it away? We're waiting for the, uh, the switch on, which should be uh, any time. Let's have a, a quick look at the uh, this one. Like I said, this is the uh, German sausage. And uh, that windmill, apparently the, the sails don't go around, so they used to go around, but they uh, don't go around anymore, sadly. But it all does light up. So hopefully, when the switch on starts, that will all be lit up as well. And like I said, you just see uh, straight ahead the, uh, the wheel of the central pier. And oh, there's the, uh, the star flyer. Again, you see the uh, lights being projected in the sky. Look at that. So we're just walking up towards the uh, the North Pier, and you can see uh, Papa's and that uh, Coyote Ugly Saloon. We've got the Shanigans, all the uh, the bars and club uh, clubs, shall I say, up this end. And uh, like I say, you got the uh, the trilogy, all sorts, and this leads all the way to the uh, the North Pier. So again, this is like the uh, the main nightlife, shall I say, um, in Blackpool, up the uh, the North Side one of the uh, old trams followed by the uh, the ambulance now the reason to take the ambulance on the uh, tram line is because the uh, promenade as you can see gets absolutely uh, heaving at night time so you can see this is the uh, the bulk of the uh, the nightlife and uh, always a, a great night in shanigans and uh, yates's and uh, all around. So I think what we'll do, we'll, uh, we'll head on uh, just up near uh, St John Square where we started and uh, come to a bit of a close of the video. So like I said, it is a, a great nightlife uh, in Blackpool. There's always plenty to do and plenty to see. So again, another great little bar, which is this one situated here. So it's the, uh, the Mitre, that one's called. Just up a little, uh, just a little alleyway leading to uh, to the town centre. So yeah, normally I don't do these uh, nightlife videos, but it is a uh, early early evening, late afternoon. It's just nice to uh, just see a bit of activity and what it's like in Blackpool. And so I think what we're going to do is finish uh, the video often, off like in the can, car. You can walk a little full length. At the, uh, so the we'll lights just take heading a towards a bit of a bit of a ride spectacular towards the uh, start of the lights on it's, uh, it's not often like that so you can you can the, walk uh, the full length amazing so we'll just take a, and a bit we'll of a past all the, uh, all all the huge hotels the cliffs towards the, the uh, start of the lights and, and uh, also the road. genting casino because they, uh, they certainly are amazing and uh, yeah they're certainly and we're going past all the all the huge hotels the cliffs the savoy and uh, also the Genting Casino. And uh, yeah, they're certainly, certainly nice, these ones. So yeah, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and any comments uh, you do leave, I will try to get back to you as soon as possible. So yeah, I'll leave
leave you with the uh, the illuminations and the uh, the boards. And until next time, take care of yourselves. And it's a it's a bye from me. Bye.